Hello and welcome to the video tutorial on getting a plane to fly with the track view. As requested by Yahoo33, that is Y-A-H-U-U-33. -U -U okay, first of all you need to go to Geom Entity. We'll go to Libraries, Vehicles, uh, Asian Transport Plane. You can use anything in the geom entities though. We'll just position this in the sky. All right, now go to view, open view pane, uh track view. We'll rename our plane to plane 1. Uh, add a sequence. That's plane. <coughs> okay, now uh, right click on uh, the. You'll see a name right here. It should say the name of your sequence. Right click on that and uh, click add selected entity node. I think you should see it like this. Uh, edit sequence. Uh, here in timing. You'll see end time, we'll just put it to 100, so we have plenty of uh, space to work with right here. Okay. Now, here you will see a little red circle, it's called record button. You need to uh, press that whenever you want to uh, make little nodes thing. Yeah. So just move your plane to your starting position. And then you can right click down here to go ahead and move it without the bar. And then you should see a little node pop up right here. You can move that however you want. Alright. Now we'll. Now, this slider right here, you need whenever you uh, want to do another node, you have to place it in a different spot. Okay, so uh, now we'll move it like this. You should see line, a line right there. Then you can turn it as well. We'll go ahead and turn it like this, so it just looks like it's flying. Go ahead and click on that again. You should see it. Now to test it out, you can just move the slider back and forth. Okay. can also to test it out press play right here and it will play it now to make it slower all you have to do is move the nodes further away from each other and to make it uh, faster you move them closer together okay and once you hit play you have to hit record again to start making it some more. I'd say that's enough for now. <coughs> now that we have that, go to Entity, Triggers, pro Proximity Trigger. Oh, and before that, you can go to Edit Sequence and uh, choose to play it however you want. You can disable HUD, disable player, you know, 
16 by 9. This puts those black bars on the top and bottom of, of the screen. Unskippable pretty much explains itself. Okay. Now you can click on your proximity trigger. We'll name it plane trigger. Okay. Adjust the parameters here. go down to flow graph, create new, if you already have them, plane, okay, open that a little bit bigger, now right click, add selected entity, should add your proximity trigger, uh, right click, add node, animations, play sequence, now up here in the inputs, you'll see sequence click on that and then click the three dots then you'll see different uh, track view sequences we have the plane right here and now enter goes into the start trigger and you can add other things to this as well but we're not going to do that right now okay now we'll Try it here. There we go. And of course, you can add sound to that and everything as well. But uh, that's that's all for this tutorial. Hope it was helpful. Thank you for watching.